Ooh. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> now that you got the effect of that. Um, I'm here in what, I, what we refer to as the iMac or computer room. The iMac room, the computer room, or the office. Mom goes up the office because we've got two desks and a filing cabinet and two, filing, two cabinets actually. Okay, so here we are in the last room of the house, the office, home office, and we are on the search for the Canon EOS 1D XS digital SLR camera, 28 to 300 millimeter lens, hopefully a two times multiplier lens, uh, speed light flash, top of the line speed light flash, two high capacity, high speed compact flash cards, um, some extra battery chargers. Extra batteries, a nice case to put everything in. Because I already got a tripod. So this is the last room we have to look for in the house. So let's begin. Let's begin a little tour and see if we can find it. Glasses on, so I see better. Okay, so we got some staplers and Windex. This is Mom's desk. Whole bunch of pins, radio, three-hole punch, uh, piano light, a picture of my dad. Uh, typewriter, that's mine, a light that I use, some pictures of the family, Brent and me, Mom, Mom and Diane Wilson, my cousin Aaron, my late grandfather, Coy Lee Duncan, light father, James Roof, and then there's a picture of me, get that light reflection out of there, of Mom and Dad at some restaurant, I'm not sure. This is technically my chair. But it's the one she uses, and that's technically her chair, but that's the one I use. Because it's very comfortable. Here's my organized closet. Where I keep my Nerf guns and computer manuals. My Star Trek videos and another my big Nerf gun. And some other manuals and books and blah 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 that nobody really cares about. Odds and ends on the end, that's not really important. Of course, here's my... Macintosh computer. I wish it was bigger and newer and faster and Steve Jobs is in a lot anymore so I can't ask him for a new one. Maybe I'll ask Tim Cook for a new one. I don't know him though. Of course I don't really know, didn't really know Steve Jobs. Anyway, it's a Macintosh computer. I love it. I wish it, just wish it was newer and better and had all the Adobe software. Nice keyboard and mouse. These are my notes of things I have to do and things I write down as I think of them. To, you know, notes for videos and stuff. My telephone answering machine, come over here, I've got my original iPod, iPod Touch, this is this case right here is the, cam the, uh, is the holder for the camera that I'm using to record this video, speaker, my all-in-one Canon uh, MX700 printer, copier, scanner, blah blah blah, stapler, for I keep my sandals, that's my chair, my desk, you get the idea. Oh, up here is the stuff you see all the time when I do videos. Everything to my Nerf gun, my YMCA helmet, my Hobart cup, my Christian flag, Dad's old scanner, a, cup, a, a Home Federal cup with an Apple sticker on it. There's Goofy, Jetfire, also known as Skyfire, but I call him Jetfire. There's Buzz Lightyear and Spider-Man in a 4-H cup, White Castle cup, Decca cup, American flag, Flowers and what you don't see behind, which I don't use in very many videos, is this headset uh, for Xbox. The wires could be cut, but and some Kleenex. Anyway, so there you have a basic overall tour. Hold on, let me get, get the lights here. <clears throat> you have a basic overall tour of my room. But the one thing we haven't found in any of the rooms, including this one, the last one in the house, um, is the Canon EOS 1D XS digital SLR camera with a 28 to 300 millimeter lens, a two times multiplier lens, a speed uh, top of the top top of the line speed light flash, extra batteries, extra battery chargers, a case, multiple compact flash cards of a high capacity speed. And storage capability, along with a case to hold everything. 
And the reason is, well, let's tell you the truth, the Canon EOS 1D XS doesn't yet exist. That's right, doesn't exist. Um, all the other stuff exists, but the actual Canon EOS 1D XS, at least officially, does not exist. We're waiting for it. We're hoping for it. Uh, the 1DX, the EOS 1DX has been announced, and it's supposed to be here uh, in March of 2012, which is like approximately two months, maybe a little bit more. So with that in mind, we're assuming that with the 1DX being 18 megapixels, there's going to be a release of a 1DXS with either 28 megapixels or 32 megapixels or somewhere in there. 28 is what we think it is because there's rumors that the 5D Mark II is going to have 28 megapixels. Or the 5D Mark III, excuse me, is going to have 28 megapixels. So we're assuming that there's going to be a 1DX with better video, higher resolution video, higher resolution uh, photo capabilities, all the advances of the 1DX plus a higher resolution and better video and all the lots of cool stuff. So I would love to review it, unbox it, you know, show you everything you can do. I hope Ken sees this video and sees how sincere I am about getting it. I mean, I would love to have it. I can't afford it because I'm sure it would be about $8,000 more than likely. Um, so I want them to send me that list of stuff so I can have it to use. Uh, I love their stuff. I, all the stuff I, you know, it's just, <clears throat> I just love it. So I'm hoping they'll, they'll send me that stuff. Um, that's all I can say about that. Uh, aside from the fact they make great stuff. Everybody knows this. But I wanted to be able to make my own, make some videos using it and showing you all the stuff it needs, stuff it can do. So there's my spiel. Uh, I could go on and on and tell you about all the, you know, a whole bunch of stuff. But I think, that, I think that pretty much sums everything up. Hadn't come out yet. We're pretty sure it is. But we don't know the names and the exact specific, you know, all that stuff. So, and we don't even know if it's going to be called an EOS 1D XS. But that's what most people assume, myself included. So, yeah, I'd like to have one for free. Address is down below uh, if you don't know it already. And um, just keep up the good work, Ken. I know you guys in Japan have been through a lot. You've had a, you've had a, in the last year or so, you've had floods, uh, uh, atomic, um, not atomic bomb, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Atom um, nuclear reactors that get, supply electricity. You've had problems with those leaking. I mean, you guys have had some serious trouble. And yeah, I know you guys are going to pull through. We've been saying our prayers for you. I know most of you probably aren't Christians, but we're Christians, so we, we say prayers. That's all we do. We talk to God and they get better. Anyway, so I know you guys can pull through. You've, got, you've delivered great stuff in the past. Looking forward to it. Even if you don't give it to me for free, I'm still looking forward to it, but hopefully you will give it to me for free. So, with that, I'd like to say thanks for watching. Have a good day. And may God bless you. I'm still waiting.